Hello, in this lecture, I would like to talk about supports and loads in Revit software. Firstly, click structure and draw floor, rectangle, and finish. Delete span directions. And now, open an analytical model in 3D views. So beams and columns, wall and floor. Click analyze and boundary conditions. Supports of points or columns and line for walls and area. So for example, this column, the support is fixed. So just select fixed. Print for the segment. So print support, roller, and user. You can specify, so the state user, then translation for X, for Y, for Z, rotation about X, rotation about Y, rotation about Z. So for example, Z, spring. And what is the Z spring modulus? And the draw. So spring, okay, like piles. Now we click line, line for walls, just select this line and draw three supports, fixed or print, whatever, and select this line, any line, user, whatever, okay. Select area and print for example, and the click. So all print. So you can add any type of supports in Revit software. You can add it in Revit, and you can add it in ETAPS and robot, whatever. In ETAPS or robot, it's more easier. In Revit, it's more complicated. Now delete. Filter, check none, boundary conditions, and delete. Now, loads, click loads. There are many types. Point loads, line loads, area loads, and the hosted point load, hosted line load, and hosted area load. Click points load any point click properties the load is dead load and the forces fz minus one mx0 my0 mz0 you can change to minus 10 for example apply and specify any points okay any points just click so minus 10 select minus 10 kilonewton if you want to add any load for a ton for example click manage project units or um click and structural and force you want the force by kilonewton by ton by pound whatever okay again analyze and loads so point load line load specify the line loads from this point to this point at minus one kilonewton okay and area load click area and draw the area so for example minus four kilonewton which is square apply in this area sketch mode And you click finish. So minus minus four kilonewton by t square in this area. And you can add it any load by hosted po point load, the principal points. So this point, for example, this point, this point, this point. So specify minus twenty, for example and apply 
and the draw so minus 20 kilo newton hosted line load you can specify one beam okay beam or beam or beam any line so just click hosted line load and finally hosted area load the total slab okay just click so minus one kilonewton meter square then this is slab 